Today's video is brought to you by Mom Jeans and a Target shirt. Hello lovelies and welcome to my channel. My name is Tahira and I am a full-time working teacher mommy. I have one son, John, who is five years old and I am married with one fur baby, Jazz. Oh. All right, y'all. So today's in today's video, I'm going to be showing what I do to prepare for the work week. I get all of my uh, shopping and cleaning and cooking done over the weekend and I just want to uh, show you you how I get things done. Hope you guys are having an awesome day or an awesome night. One eternity later. I'm back. Here is my Kroger, Publix, Dollar Tree, Ollie's, Target, and I think that's it. Oh, Big Lots Hall. So Publix, Kroger, Dollar Tree, Target, Ollie's, and Big Lots. I've been gone for a long time. Let me turn around and show you what I got cleaning bucket from Dollar Tree. I'm gonna try to remember where I got everything from. Containers, glass containers from Big Lots. Pumpkin seeds for snacking from me. I like to eat these and they're really high in fiber from Big Lots. Uh, this Colgate two pack came from Ollie's. I love baking soda and peroxide toothpaste and this double pack was only $1.99. That was from Ollie's. Uh, Big Lots, I got this uh, organic garlic Alfredo sauce. They did not give this to me in my Kroger haul, so I had to pick that up from somewhere else. Also got this from Big Lots. This is the Prego Traditional. This also came from Big Lots. This is the, the fruit snacks that my son likes, the berries and cherries. I have not been able to find dry thyme, so I saw some at Big Lots and picked that up. I got this mix and chop that I see all of the food ladies on YouTube using. And I actually found it at the Dollar Tree. I've been looking for it. I found one at the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to use that to mix up my ground turkey and ground chicken. I needed a new pop socket for my phone. Got one of these uh, strainer things if you need to pick, like, lift something out of boiling water or lift something out of, like, if you're frying, you need to lift it out of the oil got one of these from the dollar tree oh and the pop socket came from big lots all right at the dollar tree they had some pine saw concentrate i ended up going to target after the dollar tree and uh getting a big bottle of pine saw but i had not been able to find it since they said that pine saw kills coronavirus so i grabbed two of these concentrated ones from the dollar tree Got my husband some pistachios. These are two flavored ones. This one is salt and pepper, and this one is sweet chili. And I think these came from either the Dollar Tree or Big Lots. I had to get a birthday card for one of my coworkers. I am um, in charge of birthdays for my department and my job, and we have a birthday on Halloween. I got these Quest Protein Chips. Uh, we're gonna try these out. We are looking to reduce our sugar and process uh, foods as much as possible because we are on a mission to try to lower my husband's A1C. He is pre-diabetic, but not diabetic, but we wanna get his A1C down. And so these protein chips, I've seen some pretty decent reviews, so we're gonna try those out. I got this stuff for some recipes, some uh, low sodium chicken broth, two of those. Those are simple truths. I know they came from Kroger. These came from Target, by the way. This is some Arm & Hammer Carpet Fresh. This came from Dollar Tree. I needed some hair ties for my hair. These came from the Dollar Tree as well. Got some rice cauliflower for recipes this week. I'll be showing. This is uh, I don't know it, it says I think it might have just been in the like pantry aisle and I didn't know that I thought it was fresh maybe it is I don't know but I got this this is rice cauliflower two of these my husband loves sweet tea and so I got this sweet tea that has been sweetened with stevia um, so hopefully he likes it this is the raspberry kind got one sweet onion for a recipe Got my son some grape jelly. He likes grape jelly on his PB&Js. Got some light soy sauce for a recipe. Garlic for a recipe. 
husband. Oh, all of this stuff here came from Kroger. Kroger. Um, this came from Kroger as well. This is the only um, body wash that my husband likes. This is the Dove Men Care Extra Fresh. Got some Sensodyne for my husband from Kroger. This kind of toothpaste he likes. Got two lines. I know my grocery hauls all over the place. Two lines for a recipe. This Truvia uh, from Kroger too. This is what we put in our coffee. It is Stevia and Erythritol. Got some lemonade from my son. I am making him blueberry, spinach, and lemonade smoothies. And I put lemonade, frozen blueberries, and fresh spinach for him to drink. Get some veggies and fruits in. Got some honey crisp apples from myself and my son. And my, my husband doesn't really like honey crisp, but we do. Got some grapes from my son and my husband. Avocados from me and my husband. I'm going to be trying some recipes out that are made without white flour, but almond flour. So I got this almond flour. All of this stuff came from Kroger. Chopped pecans. Um, this is for, I got some low carb brownie baking mix and I wanted to add pecans to it. Got some fresh cilantro, uh, red pepper and a yellow pepper. All of this is for recipes. I'll be making egg roll in a bowl. So I had to get some coleslaw mix, some salad mix, regular salad mix. Got my baby, some Pediasure grow and gain with fiber. Hopefully he likes this. Got some Zevia Cola. This is the cola that is uh, clear and is sweetened with stevia. Got some um, diet uh, sweet tea for my husband. I got a zucchini because I'm going to be making zoodles one night. Got some bread, honey wheat bread for my son. We needed some more dishwasher tabs. Got these from Kroger. Got some whole milk for my son. All right, over here. All right, this is mixed up Kroger and Publix. The sockeye salmon fillets came from Publix. Gonna make those in a recipe this week. Got some eggs from Kroger. These are the natural brown, cage-free, grain-free eggs. Got those from Kroger. Bird's eye steamable broccoli. Got that from Kroger. Got two pounds of ground turkey from Kroger. All of this is for recipes. I'm going to be making spaghetti with zoodles and meatballs, and then the egg roll in a bowl. Got some Chobani Oat Coffee Creamer for myself. I love pumpkin spice, and I saw this, and I'm like, okay, got to have that. And I love oatmeal. Uh, butternut squash for a recipe. This is frozen. Got two boxes of mashed cauliflower for dinners this week and recipes I'll be showing. Um, got some chopped collard greens because I'm making that for dinners this week. Some corn for dinners this week. Got some no sugar added Heinz ketchup. Some tilapia for a recipe. More broccoli for a recipe. Got this, which is the smoked uh, hickory smoked turkey breast, which is the no natural no nitrates, all of that stuff. For wraps, I'm going to be making for my husband. And these carb balance wrappers that are the lower sugar higher fiber carb, uh, higher fiber tortillas, got those. Needed some more pan for baking. This really feels light. I hope I didn't get cheated. <laughs> got some extra virgin olive oil. Got some fine Mediterranean sea salt. Got some apple cider vinegar, the raw with mother. This is the Simple Truth Organic. I know everybody uses the Braggs, but this is what they had at Kroger. Got some little prune juice. I mix this with my son's juices, kind of to help him with his regularity. Got my son some golden raisins, half and half from my husband for his coffee. Got some sweet Italian turkey sausages. I actually use these to make sausage patties for my husband for breakfast. Got some chicken thighs for a recipe I'll be making this week. Got a whole chicken for some Peruvian chicken I'm going to be making in a recipe this week. Got some light sour cream, which I mix with the ranch dips and dip my celery and carrots in it. It's delicious. All right, now this is Target. Got this Metamucil for my husband. It says that it's for appetite control, heart health, healthy blood sugar levels, and lowering cholesterol and digestive health. So he is, we're going to start taking some of this every day. Found some spray Lysol, hallelujah. Got that from Target. 
As I mentioned, I got the big pine saw from Target, saw that and got it. We needed some Drano for our bathroom downstairs. This is my favorite uh, cleaner to use to mop the floors with and make your house smell really, really good. Um, this is the Mr. Clean Antibacterial Lemon. Got some of these. Now, I know everybody loves the Clorox toilet brushes, but I like these because the scrubbing bubbles ones, you can have the heavy duty, which is this one, but they also have the flushable ones and you use the exact same wand for both. So instead of using the Clorox ones where I can only use the scrubbers, I get these and I can use the scrubbers, this heavy duty, and then they also sell flushable ones if I just need to really clean the toilet really quickly like th throughout during the week, like I, I do my heavy cleaning on the weekends. All right, so for my husband, I got him some of this Lily's. This is the sugar, the chocolate bars that are made with Stevia. This is the salted caramel, so it does not have any added sugar. Got my husband some 100 calorie cashew packs. Got my husband some of these Tom's chewables. This is like uh, an acid. Um, and then got myself some of this gas prevention. Like if I eat some of those like things that are made with erythritol, it can make my stomach feel kind of weird. And so I was going to see if this helped that. I really was just going to stop eating the stuff made with that but it has such good fiber i really want to try to <laughs> do better at that so i'm gonna see if this helps all right and then this is for my son um and i think that is it now that's not everything that i got sorry got cut off um that was not everything that i got because i did get my son some christmas presents but those are hidden all right so that's my haul and i will show you my meal plan Okay guys, so here is the meal plan for breakfast. I'm making homemade turkey sausage for my husband so that he can make some breakfast wraps with these high fiber tortillas that we got. Um, he'll probably make those with maybe some fresh eggs and cheese. Um, I'm gonna be making cinnamon muffins made with almond flour and Lakanto sugar substitute. Um, I'm crossing my fingers for that. <laughs> I might throw some chocolate chips in there too. For lunches, for myself, I'm going to be having black bean and vegetable soup. I will be preparing that um, probably in my crock pot. I'm making egg roll in a bowl for my husband. Um, and then we'll also, if we run out of these two things before the week is over, we can have turkey and cheese wraps. For dinners, I'm trying a new recipe called Peruvian Roasted Chicken. We're going to have that with mashed cauliflower and roasted broccoli. I'm trying another new recipe called Southwestern Baked Tilapia. We're also going to have that with mashed cauliflower and roasted broccoli. Um, a tried and true family favorite. We're going to have crock pot honey garlic chicken thighs. I'm going to serve that over rice cauliflower with some Asian green beans. Um, I'm trying a new recipe called cilantro lime salmon. I'm serving that with cilantro lime rice cauliflower and Mexican corn. And then a family favorite, I will be making spaghetti with meatballs and zoodles. I still am going to use some regular pasta, but I also purchased some um, of those pasta zero noodles from Whole Foods. So we'll try those out too. All right, I'm going to turn around real quick. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for tuning into this video. Thank you for watching my meal, uh, my meal plan and my grocery haul. I am going to be preparing all of those uh, meals in one day. <gasps> yes, one day I cook all the breakfast, all the lunch, and all the dinners that my family will eat in one day uh, because my husband and I both work and when we get home from work, we are very tired. And if I don't already have those meals prepared we will be eating fast food or takeout and that is not good for us for our health for our well-being to eat fast food and take out all the time so to try to help myself I do put in about anywhere between five to eight hours one day a week of just getting ready getting our meals prepared for the week Stay tuned to the video where I show you how I get it all done. Uh, if you're interested, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you know whenever I post. Thank you again for watching and have a great day. Bye.